Hi everyone, welcome to SpaceX Lee. In this video, I will try to give some important updates on SpaceX. There have been a lot of things happening around SpaceX this week. To start with, SpaceX will now launch at least five back-to-back -back Crew Dragon missions for NASA to the ISS. Earlier this week, NASA has confirmed that it has decided to offload two rookie astronauts from its Starliner mission and move them to SpaceX Crew-5 mission next year. With further delays to Boeing's Starliner spacecraft, for the moment SpaceX is now the only rocket company in the USA to send humans to orbital space. It is not known when Starliner will be back to the launch pad again as it is facing terrible hardware issues. SpaceX, in yet another milestone, announced that they will use a brand new Dragon spacecraft for the upcoming Crew-3 mission which is scheduled for launch on the 30th of this month. Further have revealed that they are debuting another freshly made fourth Dragon capsule next year for the Crew-4 mission in April. With the addition of these two new Dragon capsules, SpaceX will now have a fleet of four fully reusable Dragon spacecraft. Moving on to Boca Chica, SpaceX is preparing to install the carriage chopsticks to the orbital launch tower. The carriages are currently placed on a support structure. The Kong or Frankencrane has been reconfigured to help the catching arms installation. SpaceX may install the arms anytime soon now. The seventh and the last GSE-8 tank has been placed at the orbital tank farm site. The first orbital class tank farm is near completion with just two GSEs that still need to be insulated. Trucks have been delivering liquid nitrogen to the launch site non-stop indicating a series of Starship testing. And finally, SpaceX is now a private company worth $100 billion. That is it for today see you in the next video.